All right, time for the afternoon news with Davina Smith. And Davina, some very distressing news out of Victoria. Yeah, terrible story. Amelia, good afternoon to you. A 12-month-old baby boy has died after being left in a hot car north of Melbourne. Emergency workers were called to the scene at Acacia Drive in Kyneton before three. The child was reportedly unconscious. Emergency services smashed the window of that vehicle to try and save the little boy. And at 3pm this afternoon, it was just shy of 32 degrees at Kyneton. Well, residents in Australia's north and east are preparing for two cyclones. A tropical storm Marsha is now expected to develop into a Category 3 system. That's before it reaches Queensland's Capricorn Coast tomorrow morning. But her effects will be felt all the way down to the New South Wales border. And Cyclone Lam could bring with it gusts of around 200 kilometres an hour when it hits the top end coast of the Northern Territory. We will get an update from our reporters on both systems, plus the latest advice and the warnings at 4.30. Well, police are going to extraordinary lengths in their desperate search for a toddler missing from the New South Wales mid-north coast. Detectives will track the movements of everyone who is within a one kilometre radius of William Tyrrell's grandmother's home at Kendall when he was last seen five months ago. Officers believe the little boy was abducted. They'll analyse security footage, financial transactions and phone records while interviewing hundreds of people. Fire crews have worked through the night to extinguish a blaze that took hold of a shop in Sydney southwest. The friendly grocer at Linnea was well alight when emergency services were called just after midnight. There was concerns for the uh, fire spreading via the roof space to the uh, other shops through the uh, full ceiling. Uh, fortunately we uh, had uh, we had sufficient hose lines in place to uh, prevent that from happening. Police are now waiting for the scene to be declared safe before they can start investigating the cause. Well, in the news ahead, a massive explosion reduces an oil refinery to ash. Plus, how one singer dealt with and stage intruder. And the race against time to save a pod of baby seals.